Hey guys, welcome to episode 35 of Logo History, still edition. And for this episode, we're going to take a look at Universal Pictures. So yeah, now without further ado, let's get started. This video was requested by Jahim Jahim. So check out his channel in the description below. Here's a short bio if you don't know what Universal Pictures is. It is an American film production and distribution company owned by Comcast through the NBC Universal Film Entertainment Division of, of NBC Universal. Its type is subsidiary. Its industry is film. Its predecessor is independent moving pictures. It was founded in April 30th, 1912. It's found... It, it's... Its founders are Carl Lamel or Lamel, Lam Lamel. I don't know how you pronounce it. But anyways, moving on. Pat Powers, David Horsley, William Swanson, Mark Dintonfast, Charles Bauman, Robert H. Cortrin, David Kessel, and Jules Brulator. I mean, Adam Kessel. Sorry, guys. I don't, uh, sorry about that, guys. Adam Kessel and Jules Brulator. Mm -hmm. Its headquarters are at 10 Universal City Plaza, Universal City, California, United States. Its key person is Donna Langley, chairman. Mm -hmm. Its products are motion pictures. Its parent is NBC Universal Film and Entertainment. NBC Universal Comcast. Its divisions are Universal Animation Studios, Illumination, Focus Features, and Universal Pictures Home Entertainment. Its subsidiaries are DreamWorks Animation, Classic Media, Emblem Partners, minorly, Working Title Films, NBC Universal Entertainment Japan, United International Pictures, 50%, Reda Telecine, OTL Releasing, Maker Ready, co-backing with Entertainment One Only Film and Television Production Company run by Brandon Wilson, and Black Lot Pit Music. It's, and its website is www.universalpictures.com. Okay, guys. Uh, so, yeah. N now, let's get into the logo, shall we? 1912 to 1914. Here we have the logo of the first Universal Pictures name. Universal Film Manufacturing Company. Here we have a Saturn. And inside it, there are the words Universal Films in, in black text. And on the bottom, there is, there is the word trademark in black text in, inside... inside um, a white rectangle. 1914 to 1919. Here we have a white shape and a black outline. And inside it, there are the words moving, universal pictures, and black text. 1919 to 1923. Here we have the Saturn. And, in, and on the planet, there are the words... Universal and films and white text and inside the ring there there are the words the Transatlantic Film Company Limited in black text nineteen twenty three to nineteen twenty nine they changed its name to Universal Pictures. Here we have an an earth a white earth and and in front of it there are the words and then and in front of it there are the words universal pictures and white text on a black outline and also there's like the um, moving you know moving thing I don't know how you call it but anyways moving on 1929 to 1936 there's there's a white circle and inside it there are the words universal picture and pic 
and pictures in black text and there's also two hyphens and also there's an there's an earth inside it 1936 to 1947 here we have a black and white earth and and in front of it there's a black banner and inside it there are the words universal and pictures and in white text 1947 to 1963 they changed its name to Universal International there is a black and white earth and and in front of it there are the words Universal and International and in white text 1963 they changed its name back to Universal Pictures now the text international was replaced to the word pictures. 1963 to 1990. Here we have um, uh, a black shape representing the letter U. And inside, and inside it, there is a, a white globe. 19, 19, 1990 to 1997. Now there's now there's a a white a white globe and and in front of it there there's the word universal in black text and and on the bottom there are the words N M C A company in black text nineteen ninety seven to nineteen twelve now it became modified and the words NMCA company has been removed. Yeah, that's the byline. The byline has been removed. So yeah, guys. Um, so yeah, it, the earth became modified and the font has changed. So yeah, guys. 2012 to the present now the earth became modified again and the font and the font has changed in the text universal all right guys uh that's gonna be it for this video and i'll and i'll see you one and and i'll see you guys in the next one bye oh and stay tuned for episode 36, which is going to be MSNBC. See ya, guys. Bye. See ya in the next episode.